31 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a garlic clove. And this time again I didn't leave it to chance but chose myself what I would like to paint. So I decided to paint a garlic clove. And I think it turned out very well. It looks good. Part 32 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a golf ball. This time I think only painting the golf ball was fun. Painting the grass wasn't so much fun and I just couldn't get it right. I'm also sorry that I accidentally didn't record how I painted the golf ball. I thought I was recording but apparently I hadn't pressed the record button. But yes, I don't like the end result very much, but I try to think that I could learn something new with this painting and can now improve better. Part 33 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a wheat berry. And if I'm completely honest, I was a little afraid to paint this prompt because I didn't do so well with the last one. And that, although I knew that this way of thinking is actually not so good. If I'm afraid to paint, then it usually won't go the way I want it to. But after I started painting, I had a lot of fun again. And I think the end result this time turned out very well. I like it very much. Part 34 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a gummy bear. And this time I really enjoyed painting again. I think about a year ago I drew gummy bears with color pencils, but I think the gummy bears I painted this time are much better. I generally find that since then I have gained a lot of experience in painting or drawing and have also improved. But yes, I think the end result this time turned out very well again. It doesn't look bad. Part 35 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint an amuse bush. I don't know if the pronunciation is right, but I had a lot of fun painting this time again. Somehow I always have the feeling that when I paint I'm simplifying my reference photo so I'm not painting all the details and I somehow like that style. So I think this time the end result turned out great again. I like it very much. Part 36 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a garbanzo bean. I was very surprised when I typed garbanzo bean into Pinterest where I usually search for my reference photos and I have seen many photos of chickpeas. And then I found out that chickpeas are also called gabenzo beans, what sounds somehow very funny to me. I've never heard that before. But I think the end result this time turned out really great again. I like it very much. Part 37 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint sea glass. And I'm very sorry that I forgot to record the beginning again this time. Why does this happen so often lately? In any case, I'll be careful that this doesn't happen so often anymore. But painting the sea glass was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. So I think the end result turned out very well. Part 38 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a water droplet. Somehow I was really excited to paint this prompt because I thought it would be very fun for me to paint water droplets. And it was really fun. I enjoyed painting it and I think in the end result I can also see that. It looks realistic and also alive. I think this time the end result turned out very, very well. I am very proud of it. Part 39 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint Pluto. 
And because I'm not really good at drawing circles, I decided to take a jar and sketch the circle with the help of it. And then I painted Pluto. And painting the background was really easy this time because I painted it only with black. So I think the end result turned out pretty well again. I think it looks good. Part 40 of 642 tiny things to draw. Today I will paint a mouse hole. This time searching for a reference photo took me longer than I thought it would. When I searched for a photo of a mouse hole, I found many photos of mouse holes with a mouse and I didn't want to draw a mouse, so I searched for a photo without a mouse and after searching a lot I finally found a photo of a mouse hole without a mouse, which I painted then. And I think the end result turned out good. It could be a bit better, but I am still happy with it. <laughs>